everyone, back in Squamish, British Columbia. I've uh, just had my bike all kitted out with Georgia last day and uh, pretty stoked to see how it's gonna ride. Um, I'm heading up to meet with Michaela Gatto. Uh, she's big on the Ferda girls. She's a great female ambassador for the sport. So I'm really stoked to see uh, what she's got in store for me. My name is Michaela Gatto and I am a mountain biker. I come from racing downhill. Now I'm doing more of the free ride, shooting, video, creative kind of stuff. Hey, Michaela! Oh, what's up? How's it going? Heck, not bad. Mm. How are you? Yes, I'm pretty good, yeah. Awesome. Just cruising on up. Sweet, ready to go uh, ride a trail? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I was thinking, um, have you ridden Cakewalk before? No, I haven't. All right, so I think we're going to go head up there. Okay. Talk a little bit about line choice. Sweet. Um, coming from a downhill background, you come from a cross country background, right? Yeah. So I think we're gonna look at body positioning as well. Sweet. And uh, yeah, just the importance of uh, picking line choices for your own abilities and just uh, see how it goes. Oh, sounds fun. Yeah, it's uh, something I really need to work on. So I'd be stoked right. to try it out. Perfect. Well, hopefully I can teach you something. I bet you can. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. Tried to go down here for some. Oh, I guess that's so straight oh, that way. Yeah. A lot of the times the main line isn't the fastest line. Right. It's like the sheep line. It's yeah. kind of like the path of least resistance, but sometimes it's also not the path of fast. Fast, fast resistance. <laughs> fastest, least. Fastest. 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 <laughs> fastest. <laughs> so yeah, it's good to like keep your eyes open and like, I mean, you spotted that before I did. I'd say for me, I'd probably like the smoother, well, loomery one. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Let's try yeah. it. All right, let's do yeah. it. <laughs> Jump. Oh, yeah. Entering into my line, I feel like I, because I have to make a bit of a reach to gap the roots, yep. I'm coming into it a lot faster. Right. And I know I have to like pop hard and then I land and then I get that pump off the backside. Yeah. Whereas I felt like with the middle line, your line. Yep. It's a bit tricky going into, but I also don't feel like going into it slower, I'm coming out with more speed than the high line. Right. Does that okay. make sense? Yeah. Because you want to have good exit speed. So yeah. it's okay sometimes if it's hard to get into something, as into a line, as long as you come out of it faster and you can go through it faster. Okay, so should I try that other line and just sort of see for me how yeah, that feels? Yeah, for yeah. you okay. though. All right. Let's see, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, because that root's <laughs> one to watch. But yeah. if you go to the right of it, yeah, maybe I can just come up a little higher and see see what's going on. Like yeah. almost do a little hill climb. I got you. Up. Hey! I mean, that was pretty good. It felt a little slow just because I don't think I got that. I didn't land on the down like you did. Yeah. Like, if I could get a bit more confident, a little bit more. Uh, a little bit more air time perhaps, so I could kind of keep it going. Yeah. Maybe that would be faster. Pop up high. Okay. It's a bit of a move. Okay. Give it a All right. Oh, yeah! yeah. <laughs> Much oh. better. <laughs> yeah, way better. Yeah. yeah. Sweet, thanks dude. No worries. Sweet. Yep. Yeah, that was amazing. I'd just think, oh yeah, I'm gonna case it, I'm gonna case it, but with enough speed and with the right line, and like you said, staying up more than you think, yeah. gave you plenty of clearance to keep it smooth. Yeah, that was perfect, that was so perfect. Okay, so come to this section of trail here with multiple line choices, and uh, we're gonna see, oh, here comes Michaela, see what it looks like. Sweet. This next section, I kind of want to go right left to this, right of that, straight down the guts, and exit with some speed. All right. <laughs> so you do it. <laughs> so that's how you do it. <laughs> um, I found the two times that I just did it. For some reason, I wanted to be pushed over here. Oh, okay. So. 
but you don't want to be over there. No. So be mindful of that. So you want to be left of the tree, yeah. right of the rock. Those are your two kind of mental points. points to think about when you're entering this line. A lot of the times in technical stuff like this, you can get on the brakes and you can kind of like get, down get your ahead. head down to like focus on what's going on, but then you can't plan ahead. And the thing with line choice is making a plan that can be executed throughout the whole line. Because as soon as you do this, yeah. it's you're like, going there. <laughs> yeah, you're pretty much, you're doing this. Yeah. <laughs> At this point, you're probably going to have a bit more speed. Yeah. Just know that there's nothing that can really go wrong here. Just stay right to the tree yep. and it'll shoot you out off the next section. So did you just kind of like launch off this or did you like Don't, I wouldn't or? pop. I would like, eat like a little bit. Like, a little bit of a <laughs> so you're not like getting, so this doesn't like buck you. Okay. And so you're kind of like unweighting, but then you're pushing, you want to like push the, push the front end down. Cause right. if you pull up over this, it's if true. you're going kind of fast, you're going to end up with less down <laughs> oh, right. the mountain. Okay. Nice. <laughs> so she's going to do that one more time. I noticed a little bit of body positioning going on there that she could improve on. I'm going to use my phone to film her um, because I find it's way easier for the rider to see what they're doing and make adjustments rather than me just trying to use my words and explain what she's doing. That's okay, but then you see as she gets kind of into the steeper bit, her butt drops back there and she's getting real, real crouchy. She's really, really crouching over the bike and her arms are bent. She's off the back of it. So I think she could stand up a little taller on the bike. She's more relaxed because you've got the body positioning. Mm -hmm. It's just Long you crunched up yeah. okay. when you yeah, so nice. it's like staying, I would say more, a little bit more forward. Okay. Like be strong on your yep. arms. Yep. You want to feel like there's sort of an even balance of arm and leg. And between both wheels too. Yeah, I think I'm, yeah. I definitely feel that I'm like putting everything back here because it's like, yeah. you know when you ski, mm -hmm. you're like, oh. Yeah, <laughs> so yeah. Like, no, you want to get into it. It's flying. That's better. That's yeah. Better. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Very subtle because you are still crouched. Yeah. But it's definitely, you can see that, I mean, you're smiling and you're a bit more <laughs> upright and you look more confident. So you're like more, more like yeah. up and relaxed. Like you said, there's a slight difference, but it, yeah, it made, it, yeah, it definitely made a difference. It went way faster. Mm -hmm. Hey, yeah, I mean. I would say it's fairly straightforward, but it is hard to pull off. Yeah. What you don't want to do is end up in here. All right. Because you've got this guy here, gonna spit you which you're going to automatically, subconsciously avoid, which is then going to send you to make a death. down <laughs> yonder. You want to get up onto this, get over this. This is where you want to be. Right. And then it's just a straight shot. Watch your brakes through here. Right. You don't want to be slamming the brakes. You want to do most of your braking on the entrance yeah. so that you can kind of roll it out of the exit. Okay. Because if you're coming in hot and then slamming on your brakes in the middle of the line, that's gonna, like your suspension doesn't work as well, your tires won't be spinning, so you're not gonna get as much traction. Everything just kind of goes to hell in a handbasket. Yeah. Okay, so putting the drops into practice, that's kind of what I'm most nervous about here. Yeah? No, <laughs> that you just roll off. You're just, you're just gonna... Okay. Over the root, over that, over this, hey! Just get in that V. Yep, yep. Not too much, yeah, nice! Yeah. <laughs> Woo <-hoo> -hoo, sick! <laughs> that was good! Nice, yeah! <laughs> Normally, if I'd seen that drop, I'd have been like, oh, I can't take it. How's it going? <laughs> uh, so I'd try and go around it, and that would have been way worse. So I'm stoked now that that goes and had that little pop and that line choice. And what Michaela was saying about getting the speed before you get there so you're balanced, and then you can kind of let her go a little. I still was a little bit freaky, but it was okay. Oh, nice. 
So do you feel like you learned something? Yes, I think for sure going with the line choices first and you know, thinking that, oh, this line works better than this line, but when you ride both of them, you realize that, hey, actually this line's faster and more flowy. Like, cause I was saying, I didn't think that the roots would be a better way to go, cause I'm not good at roots, but then when you give me some advice on just getting, unweighting the bike a little bit, made it way smoother. Good. And yeah, that was sweet. Sweet. Um, yeah, and definitely what you're saying about the body position as well yeah. on the steeps and lifting up a little more and mm -hmm. keeping even weight on both wheels yeah. felt way smoother. Good. Well, I, I noticed a little bit of a difference and yes. hope you did too. <laughs> and you've got a lot more coaches to, you know, show you the way. And I'm really excited to see maybe at the end of all this, how, how you're feeling and what your confidence is like. And maybe we yeah. can go for a shred. That'd be sweet. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> all right. <laughs> All right, had a sweet day on the trails riding Cakewalk with Michaela. Uh, got some pointers on body position and line choice. So you can check those off. Now I just gotta do my homework, go practice. Um, but it felt way better, learnt lots. Uh, so let's see how these skills transfer uh, going forward with some more coaching. So let's see what happens. It's all very subtle if you come in with the right amount of momentum. Uh, death grip, let's go.